Right now it looks like CT is going to make it to Australia in December and be part of the international team at the President's Cup. Uh, I'm just trying to play every day and do my best out there and hopefully I'll be on the team and then help more guys, help more kids to grow the game at the same time. Being able to play for the President's Cup that will mean the world to me. Got it. Boy, is that nice. For Chinese Taipei CT Pan, life is but a dream. And from the time he was a small boy, those dreams have revolved around the game of golf. My mom used to be a caddy at a golf club. My dad brought my brother and me to visit my mom, and then we, and then we just started playing golf, and it was fun. <laughs> when I was 12, I started playing well, started feeling that I can, you know, I can do something out of it. At age 15, he enrolled at IMG Academy in Florida and went on to receive a scholarship to the University of Washington. My four years there were crucial to me. I told myself I have to seize this uh, opportunity. Winning eight times and emerging as one of the top amateurs in the world. I'm still far away from where I wanted to be. Overall, everything's, you know, it's pretty good, but you know, there are a lot of good players on the PGA Tour, and in order to get there, you need to be pretty dang good. After turning pro in 2015, Pan won twice on the McKenzie Tour, PGA Tour Canada, yes. securing his Corn Ferry Tour card for 2016, where he finished 11th on the money list to punch his ticket to the PGA Tour. CT Pan, rookie on the PGA Tour. But once on the PGA Tour, Pan found success much tougher than expected. Among the younger players, you know, the competition is so hard right now, so everyone knows that you have to play really well in one week to be able to win tournament. A pair of runner-up finishes at the 2017 Farmers Insurance Open. And the 2018 Wyndham Championship kept the dream alive but that coveted PGA Tour title remained elusive. PGA Tour was, was always like a dream. Golf is a tough game. When the opportunity comes, you have to seize it. That opportunity came back in April when he played himself into contention at the RBC Heritage. And when he lipped out for birdie on the 72nd hole, he felt his ultimate dream slipping away. Get up and go. Oh my gosh. Oh, joking. Good gosh. When I missed the putt, the birdie putt on 18, I thought that was, uh, I'm so close to, you know, secure the win. It ended up a very good, happy ending for me. The part was good enough for me on 18, and I was very emotional. Congratulations to CT Pan. Honestly, every morning I wake up and I told myself I'm a PGA Tour winner. Uh, I, st I st still having a hard time to believe it, uh, but it's true and I did it. I've worked my past 22 years just for these moments and, uh, you know, just a lot of hard work, a lot of hours, and actually a dream come true. After a tie for third at the Charles Schwab Challenge, Pan made it all the way to the FedEx Cup playoffs and a berth on the President's Cup International Team. To be part of President's Cup International Team, it means the world to me, and, and that's another dream come true for me.